So what's up guys, I'm back. Today I'm going to show you how you can install iOS 11 right now without a computer or without losing any data. So this is the final version we'll be seeing in few days and Apple will push out the same build number and the same firmware on 19th of September. But you can get it right now without a computer. So you can see we have all the visual changes, all the new wallpapers, all the performance and speed bumps right in the software right here. You can perform it on any iPhone above 5S. I'm going to show you and do it on an older firmware. So you can see I'm on iOS 10.3.3. Now make sure you do it on Safari and not on Google Chrome or any other browser, that way it won't work. Now go to this page, it's Apple's beta program page, the link is just down below. It's not a beta version, it's actually the final version, but you get a profile from this page only. So go there, click on enroll your device, it may take a while to load. Once it's done loading, make sure you're on the iOS tab and not on the Mac or the TV OS. Once you're right there, scroll down and click on download profile. From there, it will prompt you to allow or ignore. Make sure you click on allow, so you'll be redirected to your settings. So click on allow, and it opens settings right away. From there, you can see it's verified. You won't get any virus. It is probably signed by Apple. And if you already have this, you don't have to go to this process. Just click on install, install, and click on install for the last time. And from there, click on restart. Make sure you restart your phone. If you have a passcode, just fill the passcode, and then restart it. Now, it may take a while for your phone to restart, but guys, make sure you connect it to a safe Wi-Fi connection and have 50% battery or more than that or you're connected to a power source. Now once your phone is done restarting, just unlock it, go into settings, scroll down, go to general, go to software update. Now I have to wait for a while, few seconds only until you see the update on your phone. But guys, it's totally safe, it's the final version. You'll be able to upgrade in future, you won't lose and boom right here we have iOS 11. 1.1 gig now I have an iPhone 6s so it depends on the phone you own the update can be bigger or smaller like on my iPhone 6 it was 1.90 gigs but I hope you guys enjoyed the video more content coming soon until then peace